Hi guys, it's your girl Sakile here. Thank you so much for tuning in. Um, welcome to the new vlog. And in today's vlog, as you can see by the title, I am moving in address. Basically, like it's part of my vlog. I'm moving in address, and I'll just be showing you guys videos of me settling guys i've been waiting for this moment for so long thank god like i am so grateful to god for you know giving me this chance and this opportunity to you know go back to race and yeah finish my final year basically so yeah so mind you guys this is going to be so messy because i have a lot of schoolwork like i have so much schoolwork that I need to finish by the end of the day so I'm not going to be able to have time to do everything at once like unpacking and you know so I'm just going to show you guys how my room looks like right now this is how my room currently looks guys like oh it's so messy like everything is like I'm a box number box it's such a mess but I don't think I'm gonna have time to unpack everything right now to be quite honest because I have so much work to do and I need to catch up so I think I'm just going to be showing you guys my bed like how I do my bed and stuff like that but I'm not sure because guys I'm I haven't bought the things like okay I do have like the sheets because I use like white sheets and white juvade so the other things like pillows i wanted to buy them so i don't think i'm going to be showing you guys how I, like like you know setting up my bed so i guess you guys just have to wait guys she received the most amazing email ever like Like, I will be working with a brand that I've always wanted to work with. Like, I've always wanted to work with this brand. Like, always. And it's finally happening. Like, it seems like everything is coming together right now. Considering how these past three months were, like, a mess. guys i'm so happy like i don't know how to express it but i am so happy and i'm so grateful to god for everything that he does and sorry there was just someone passing because i thought they'd just look at me while i'm filming i'm so thankful to god and i pray that he continues to bless me i don't know how to express it I'm so happy guys but anyways i just came to say that because i know when if i like announce it um if i announce it um a few days from now it's not gonna be as you know because i just got the news now so you guys should stay tuned Hi guys, so we have arrived um, at our um, accommodation. So I don't know if I've to if I have told you guys already, but I'm actually here for a wedding. I'm doing the bride's makeup, so this is where I will be staying. And I'll yeah yeah basically this is where I'll be staying. And then tomorrow morning, I'll go do the bride's makeup back at home. It's like a short distance from her house. So, yeah. Wait, let me actually show you guys the place. So these are the rooms. These are the rooms. And...
hi guys good morning thank you so much for tuning in this is the next day um after my trip to northwest but yeah i was just trying to show you guys like the beautiful views and yeah that's basically it and so today it's a sunday and i want to go do my grocery shopping as you guys know that i moved in on thursday and from thursday i haven't bought any groceries and i have realized that the more i delay on buying my groceries the more i spent money on unnecessary things and foods that i wasn't even planning to eat for this year so for this year i am planning to be on the healthier side hopefully i pray that i keep my focus and stay consistent i'm planning on being on the healthier side and join the gym and yeah i have realized that i always told myself that i am comfortable with how i look of course i am comfortable with how i look i love my body but i feel like a little bit of weight loss could make so much difference and it can like make me so happy especially because of the clothes that i love to wear like i love streetwear i love um cargoes i love all those kind of things and i have realized that shops don't shops don't um have like bigger sizes of nice clothes and it really hurts me like all the time like every time i have to fit an item that i love and it doesn't fit me i feel like dying to be quite honest because yeah so that's what i want to do for this year and i don't want to force myself or make it seem like oh my goodness you have to lose weight you have to lose weight i just want to do it in my own pace and be as healthy as i've always wanted to be and i'm not necessarily gonna cut out like a lot of foods i'm just gonna stick to the foods that i used to eat but i'm just gonna cut out the portions i'm gonna manage my intake so yeah that's what i'll be basically doing for this year um, and that is my plan and i hope i stay consistent in it so today back to the plan i want i am going on like a grocery run and i want to buy oh i want to buy oh guys sorry <laughs> so i'm in my pink girl era so i would love to get like a pink pillow case or a pillow or pink sheets or a pink mat or you know i'm in my pink girl area so i just want i don't last year i've realized that my room was more neutral and white and beige and cream and this year i'm keeping those colors but i'm adding pink just to have that pop of color in my room so that's what we will be doing anyways guys thank you so much for tuning in again i don't know if i've said that thank you so much for tuning in please 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 subscribe please subscribe guys it's free and click on the notification bell so that you can receive notification guys my skin period so that you can receive notifications every time i upload a new video and you are up to date with what i upload so that is it for me for now bye i'm going to be taking a shower and i don't think i'm going to be taking you guys with i'm just gonna end the video here so bye oh because it's a sunday and shops close close early so i don't want to be wasting time filming so bye guys back again i am done preparing to go so let us go
so guys I'm starting at spa first and then I'll finish off either Woolworths or pick and pay so yeah because the prices here are like oh shit I forgot my card oh like my spa rewards card So guys, now what I'm doing is I'm just basically taking out all the clothes from the boxes and from the bags and I just want to organize them in my old job and make everything look super neat. Hey guys, I'm back again. I hope that you guys are good. So, um, today I haven't been doing much. That's why I didn't vlog anything really. I haven't been, I haven't been doing much. I've just been finishing up some schoolwork, and then that's basically it. I just took a shower right now. I'm waiting for my nail before. I'm waiting for the nail tech to come and do my nails and. Yeah, that's literally it for today, to be quite honest. Nothing much. So, yeah. Hi guys, welcome, welcome back. So, it is the next day. And as I have told you guys um, later on yesterday that 
I am going to be getting my nails done and yeah love them so much excuse me and as I have told you guys that there was so much okay there was so much work going on right in terms of school work I had to finish up an assignment I was so stressed because of that and then another thing there was like nothing much going on because because I was trying to finish up my assignment and literally I had no life going on so there was nothing to film so today I have a client right in two hours I have a client and we are getting her makeup done after that I am going to do my hair in brown so that's a little bit you know not so boring considering how these past few days I haven't been doing nothing really I haven't had time to do anything so yeah that's what we're doing today and yeah let us get to taking a shower and tidying up my room I would just take you guys through all of that So guys, I have already, I have already picked out an outfit, and this is what I'll be wearing. Just something simple, and these red pants, black red pants, and this black top. I don't know if you guys can see that properly, but yeah, that is my outfit for the day. I don't know which shoes I'm gonna wear, but I'm thinking of going with the the night dance. So, yeah. Guys, we are back at home. The time right now is the time right now is ten. I came back here half past nine, and I'm so hungry, but I don't want to eat anything heavy. So, I think I'll just make spinach paste or pasta, something like that. That is not too heavy so that's what i'm gonna be doing right now anyway let me show you guys my hair i love it so much well i'm still wait i'm still not comfortable with it yet because it's a bit painful but yeah this is how basically looks like i love it and yeah let me go make some food 
so guys this is what i made i know it looks gross but it's really good it's spinach pesto um i mixed spinach almonds olive oil cheese salt pepper what else oh and a sweet chili sauce and then i blended it together with a little bit of water so yeah this is so good guys it's really good so guys i'm done eating my dinner and i'm so tired and i just want to go to bed and get enough rest for tomorrow because i have to wake up early not too early but i have to wake up early so i need to get enough sleep to be able to be more productive as I want to be tomorrow, today actually. So, yeah, I will see you guys in the morning. Good night. Good morning, guys. So, I just like came back from Campus Square to get a few things that I needed. Actually, I don't know if I, I'm not sure if I needed them, but I had to get them. So, um it's gonna be like a little unboxing kind of video where i show you guys what i bought and stuff like that so for i went to clicks mr price home pick and pay uh pep home and neighbor good market in campus square if you know you know so first we want to start with pick and pick and pay pick and pay so from Pig and Pay, I only got one thing, which is this. It's a caramel flavored coffee syrup. So here's the thing, right? I'm trying to be a morning person. I'm trying to like up my morning routine game, something like that. So I thought to myself, hey, so if there's one thing that I know will keep me interested to wake up it's definitely coffee so i thought maybe if i get myself some caramel because i love caramel iced coffee so if maybe if i up my morning iced coffee game then it will give me motivation to wake up and yeah that's the only thing i got from pick and pay the second thing I'm gonna go with Mr. Price because I also got one thing. <sighs> so from Mr. Price home, I got this cute glass. It's actually like big enough. It was 45, 46 round. I'm not sure if you guys can see. But yeah, this glass, I'm gonna use this glass for my morning coffee, like for my iced coffee because it's like big enough and it's it's really cute i love it so and i've realized that the more you have cute and interesting things to like use for like your food your drinks so like the more interested you are in making those things so i don't know if i'm making sense but hopefully i am okay and then thirdly clicks so from Clicks, I only got it. Okay. So from Clicks, I got this because I'm also trying to like layer my scents. Um, I want to smell good, and I've so I've seen this other TikTok saying that if you want to smell good all day, you need to like layer your scents. I mean, I've been doing that, but I feel like I needed this body mist or spray because it goes like it, it's like a perfect fit for like the fragrances that i already have yeah and then i got this dove body wash along along with the bar the dove bar and then i okay, can a little skew okay. and then from 
now it's pep home right so pep home i got this cloth well i'm gonna use this for my dishes but before i do that i want to use this to make my celery juice because i'm gonna okay, i'm gonna blend the celery together with the water and then i'm gonna strain it with this so that the the celery things like they stay on this and then i'm left with the juice underneath so this is what i'm gonna use it for and then i got these gloves these body gloves i mean i really have blue ones but i don't like blue i got them for my mom i don't like blue so yeah i got those gray ones and then i also got this glass so this glass i'm going to use it for juice mainly juice maybe, maybe juice and smoothies or my overnight oats i don't know i will see okay okay that's done now interesting um i went to neighbor supermarket so i got these lashes i mean i already have lashes but i feel like i needed a little bit more subtle lashes i needed simple lashes i don't want to do too much them like most lashes that i have are too much so yeah and then i got these stainless steel straws that is basically like mental straws <gasps> guys uh, look i got these right and they go with this and then me i got these extra ones I check because I don't know why I didn't check because this has like I don't know if you guys can see it has its own washing thing and then I got like a full pack of these because I didn't see that these had anyway moving along and then I got a lash glue And I got this plate. It's it's like a medium sized plate. It's really cute, I like. Oh, yeah. This this plate is really cute. I love it. And. Oh. I got this and um, this is a, like another plate this bigger this is bigger I don't know if you guys can show you so, oh, this is the plate and this is the I mean it's not that there's not much difference but I like this one I like that like this I don't know if you guys can see but yeah I like this and then this one the edges are like more like this one and then these one this one they, they're like the edges the edges are more curved so yeah and it's big enough this is gonna be for dinner and then I don't know what I'm gonna use this for but like I love it so yeah that's what I got in total so currently there's no shedding and luckily I don't have anything to worry about because my clothes oh i don't know if i've told you guys but tomorrow today i'm going out to an art gallery date kind of thing i wouldn't call it a date because it's like i'm going with a girl so that's what i'm going to be doing today we're going to an art gallery and i'm going to be i'm going to be taking pictures for factory so that's what I'll be doing. I don't know if I should show you guys my outfit right now, but I think I should because I love it. So let's do that. I don't know if I'm trying to look for a t-shirt that I matched the pants with. So I wanted to show you guys this angle so that you guys don't feel alone when you guys don't see what I'm getting up to. So hey boo. Sleepless keep. Oh, nice. Found it. Yeah. 
so i found it and then now i'm gonna look for a sweater but the sweater is like very close so i'll show you guys the entire outfit when i'm done picking out the sweater i got the sweater let me show you guys Oh, let me actually remove this glass there. Okay, so first starting off with pants. So these are the pants I'm wearing. It's like really cool sweatpants. And then along with this top, I don't know if you guys can see it properly, yeah, that's the top. And then I'm gonna have this sweater. I'm not wearing it, me. Like it matches the, the pants. I'm not wearing it. I'm just gonna do a little something like this, something like this. Oh, something, you know just to make uh, the, the outfit more interesting so that's what i'm gonna be doing and i'm now i'm gonna be wearing my my nike dunks yeah that's the outfit let me get to um getting ready and i'm thinking of getting ready with you guys so yeah i'll be showing you guys how i do my makeup but like not in depth just like a little bit so yeah <sighs> so guys I, I we literally don't have time i have i probably have an hour and 10 minutes to finish it up to finish everything and i'm just going on with my moisturizer and I'm using this brown leaf oil just to. I use this when I feel like my skin is dehydrated a bit. So. It kind of sucks that I can't play music because of coffee, right? But that's cool. I feel like not having to play music will make me move faster. Anyways, I already did my iced coffee it is so good guys i'm never ever buying mcdonald's iced coffee ever again this is good i'm thinking of putting it here because it's here one thing about me i'm clumsy ah! Let's see. okay let me position you guys properly okay i I'm going to start with the foundation. Okay, yeah. That looks better. Okay, and then now. This foundation, this foundation, it matches me so perfectly. Oh. Yo, what about me? It's Pongo San. Really, really. Okay. but anyway maybe i can talk about my my moving process or how my year because i keep saying i'm sure you guys are wondering i keep saying oh my goodness my year was such like ever since this year started it has been nothing but like 
really bad da, 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 da. and i'm sure you guys are wondering like what is making this year so bad that's probably the question okay thing is guys um beginning of this year so i am an nsf student and also i'm part of a scholarship right so before I, I i had i've had my scholarship since 2020 since my, since my first year so now my scholarship only offers 70,000 a year and that is not enough so i decided to opt with ns first instead but my scholarship is still supporting me i'm still going on camps they are still topping me up if i need to so it's just been there for like moral support right Shop. So this year, I go put me. You guys, excuse me, like if you go call me Suzuki because some of the things make no sense. My was call me Suzuki. So I'm not going to be as well. But I know majority. I don't. Let me not. Let me not even assume. But so this is what happened, right? Um. I oh I wasn't unblocked unblocked isn't unblocked yes I wasn't unblocked to register so, yeah I wasn't unblocked to register so it was kind of delaying me in a way so I was at home the entire time because I was not at school and I was not able to register but my mom finally made a plan and she registered she paid for my registration so yeah she paid for my registration and I ended up going to school and then now I'm just worried because of accommodation and mind you i stay in soweto i stay in soweto so having to travel from soweto to like Auckland park campus i mean it's not that far but you guys it gets exhausting after some time especially if you have 8 a.m classes imagine having to wake up at like 5 a.m to attend or like 4 a.m because i'm really slow so imagine waking up at like four half past four just to attend an 8 a.m class and what's worse is that it's the only class that i have in a day so that is crazy and i just even get to my engine delay because i was like i'm never spending so much money for transport just for me to attend one class mm -mm. I saw it. so it was kind of like i felt like being really moving into the school understand like my school stuff like having to attend lectures and stuff like that so and considering that this year i was planning to like be more focused on my school work because i'm doing my final year right so i felt kind of delayed yeah. cool and then next was the list i think it put me so far put my list out three when we're in as fast put my list out three and your girl is not on the list like it has been stressing me out like i don't appear on the list and if i don't appear on the list it means that i can't get my allowances and i can't register and i can't find accommodation that's what it means and it was stressing me the hell out right so now um we found my friend and i found a race ne, in joburg cbd like it is that that race is the bottom of the barrel like it is the ghetto so my friend and i were like you know what we we're willing to compromise and just like stay there in the meantime we're waiting for our staff to putting those it is long we go to that race they tell us you guys can move in tomorrow ah sharp we get all excited like yes we finally getting a chance to move yeah, well, I tomorrow sana <laughs> yeah i pack my things like, 
my friend helps me to pack my things we pack we pack we pack we pack we pack mind you my things are a lot into them is new i we pack we pack we pack we pack how mother's figure lap they tell us like no you guys are not on the list so you can't move and then we're like we came jay is all and we explained it to you guys that we're not on the list and you guys said we could come hi but you know eh, that is not allowed we had to take all those things we had to take all those things and move them back home because that day i even considered deregistering like i wanted to deregister because like ew, it was so stressful so anyway that's what happened and then um I, I feel like most if there's something that made me feel really bad most like in this situation was the fact that i felt so rejected like i felt so rejected i felt like oh my goodness god i even like seeing this i even seeing how i'm struggling like it was really bad that i just i felt so out of place guys like i felt so out of place i i there's some point where i even started doubting that, that god exists like why are you not doing anything about this i'm struggling i'm being delayed and there's so many things that i feel like at home it's not that much of a good environment for me so it was very stressful because of that so i was just feeling trapped at home and i was feeling really stressed and worried about my future because i feel like this this entire thing is like something that is not as big right but but this situation just um changed my mind it's into me thinking um how can i put this i don't know how to put this into me thinking that like i got so anxious like i got so anxious about my future and i started wondering like what's going to happen and if god is going to pull up for me pull up I, whatever it is yeah if god is going to be like Danam, i got you back so i stayed at home i stayed i had no choice but to stay so um as you guys have seen on my vlog i went out on a camp with my scholarship few weeks ago actually we went to a camp and this lady asked me like how's everything go like uh, <gasps> oh my goodness uh, i feel like this is going to be really bad okay i think it's a bit better so this lady right one boat was like how is everything going in school and stuff like that this lady is from old mutual yeah she's the one that is like um responsible for my financial whatever's like a the student officer as well as a financial officer like yeah whenever i need something i just go to her so she asked me, Mam Chay Lagay, Matmina I haven't registered. Da, 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 da. My mom ended up paying for my registration. And she was like, Girl, why did you what did, why did you not say anything about that? So I was like, No, I don't want to be like um like bothering you guys, whatever. I was still also waiting on NS Fast shop. This lady's like this lady's like girl don't worry we got your back so what they did was they paid for my rent where i'm staying they're paying for six months and actually not even six months it's just like a a travel run sana why are they standing there oh my goodness they're making me so awkward but anyway 
Oh, Sana. Oh, Sana, Bami. my window is facing the entrance of the race so abantu bebengena babuke wendila bayangibona so it kind of creates an awkward scene <laughs> anyway so anyway this lady k they paid for my 6 months at race in the meantime and they also paid for my allow they also gave me my allowances and stuff like that they were like, girl, go stay at rest, you know. So here we are at rest now. And I'm honestly the happiest girl ever. Like, I am so happy, guys. You guys don't understand. I am so happy and I'm so grateful to God that he finally pulled up. Pulled up, pulled up. And that's it. I pulled up for the girl. She was like, Girl, don't worry, I got your back. She was like, Was all that right? Just relax and be patient. Basically, this whole situation taught me so much patience, guys. Anyways, I feel like while I'm filming this whole thing, I'm wasting so much time because it's now one and I need to be leaving at half past. So anyways, um, yeah, the story ends there. Like they ended up paying for my accommodation and uh, my allowances. And now we are here and yeah, I'll just show you guys the final look because I'm trying to make everything so quick so that I get there on time. Ne? Sharp. I'm off my Uber and I I'm basically here at the gallery and yep I'll just show you guys I don't know really because I've made a vlog in this I've made a vlog in this gallery before so I'm not sure I'll just take a few snippets for you guys so yeah bye What are you are you vlogging as in like now? <laughs> and then you, you oh you didn't start now. So you're vlogging it a day. Okay. Oh last time I came here it was like that's actually nice. It's what? It's a what? So guys, I'm going back home now and I don't think I'll vlog after I get home because I had a lot to drink. So yeah guys, bye. Wait, am I actually like I'll see you guys on the next one. <laughs> anyway, bye guys. Thank you so much for watching my vlog. By the next one, please don't forget to subscribe, comment. How much is one? How much is one? Oh, it's so cute. I don't have cash though. I don't have cash, but they look so cute. Thank you. Though. Anyways, bye guys. Thank you so much for watching this vlog. Please don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, and yeah, I'll see you guys on the next vlog. Bye.